Hey guys, Justin here for SNS Archery, and today's gear video, we have another site here from Black Gold that's new. Uh, this is going to conclude the Pro Hunter HD Streamline series. Today's gear video, we're going to be focused on the dovetail version. All right, guys, so getting right into this one here. Um, yesterday, I did a video on the Pro Hunter HD Streamline series site with the quick link mount for the Hoyt bows. But today is all about Matthews and the bridge lock technology. So, this is Rob's setup. Uh, he let me borrow it here to do the video. We're going to show you the differences between the Pro Hunter HD Streamline versus the original. So, we'll get right into it. All right, so taking a look at the new Pro Hunter HD Streamline, uh, my first impressions of this site is just overall weight. This thing is extremely light, comes in at 8.5 ounces, uh, machined aluminum, made in the USA, lifetime warranty on these sites. Uh, I personally have never had any of my sites break. Very rarely do we see any issues with these sites. So they are definitely uh, made to last and definitely for hunting. So the Streamline series site, the Pro Hunter HD, it really came out for a couple of reasons. Uh, one, to be more specific to uh, specific bow builds and how they're gonna mount. Um, so here, I have the Matthews bridge lock system, which utilizes the dovetail going right through the center of the riser. Uh, and then yesterday's video, I showed you the quick link, uh, which is a direct mount to the Hoyt bows. So that is number one. We're getting the ability to buy these direct, uh, whether it's the dovetail or the quick link. Uh, no longer are you having to buy a stock Pro Hunter HD with an X-Frame uh, base and then upgrade and buy an additional quick link or the dovetail. So uh, this comes directly on it. Uh, this is going to save us a little bit of money. Uh, very nice to have. Uh, the second reason that they came out with this site is conflict with your windage bar and your hand when you're trying to dial out for long distance shots. So as you can see here on the standard Pro Hunter HD, Rob has this all set up, sighted in. This is where he's been shooting all season long. But if you take a look at this, as I'm going to dial out, my hand is really close to the windage bar here on the side. So it's almost to where I have to sit back and just dial out differently than I would want to as far as just reaching over. So uh, what Black Gold has done is they've created a much shorter windage bar. Uh, this is definitely going to give you way more clearance as you're dialing out for those shots. So it was unnecessary to have such a big windage bar because our sight was mounted to the side of the bow. But now with these new bows, the bridge lock, we're shifting the sight back over to center. And so the housing is actually going back the opposite direction in order to get sighted in. So we don't need a whole bunch of windage. So that's why they made the change. So as you can see here, we have the stock Pro Hunter HD versus the new Streamline, much smaller windage bar. Uh, and like I said, this is really to uh, give our hand a lot more clearance here on the Pro Hunter HD. I'm really close. So as I'm dialing out my hand on my finger here almost hits immediately um, versus the new Streamline that has a lot more clearance. So when we look at the features of the Streamline versus the Pro Hunter HD, are pretty much the same straight across the board other than that windage bar, and you don't get a side mount bracket. So if you're planning on using this site on a different bow and not utilizing the bridge lock, more than likely your windage bar is gonna to be too small. You're gonna run out of adjustment trying to get back to center. So that is one thing to consider. If you end up switching bows, this might not work. So very bow specific on these new builds. Um, but this is gonna come stock just like this. You have a four inch dovetail. If you wanted to do a six, we could do a custom order for you. Uh, in that case, you can also change your pin colors and sizes. Um, just know that there's a little bit of a lead time on those, couple weeks, um, but Black Gold's been pumping them out really fast. The four inch dovetail and the six inch dovetail are gonna come with third axis adjustment. So this is crucial for guys wanting to shoot steep uphill, downhill angles here in the West. You, you never know what angle you're gonna be shooting. So having that set up correctly is huge. Moving forward on the site up towards the pistol portion of the site, uh, because there is a dial here, this is a fully adjustable sliding site, meaning the housing is going to move up and down. I can start with set pin distances. So three pin here, say 20, 30, 40. If I want to dial out and shoot 
80, 90 yards on the 3D course, I can by utilizing these side tapes. The way these sight tapes go on, how to select these, we have a whole nother video on this process. I'll go ahead and put the link right here. Um, but if you guys get through that video, still not quite sure on how that works, um, definitely give us a call or email us. We're, we're here to help you guys. Moving up to the windage bar and the elevation bar, they're beefy in size. Uh, they're not gonna flex on you whatsoever. Um, what you're not gonna see on this site versus say the pro site is there's no micro gang or micro pin adjustment. So you can see here, this is basically, you have an Allen screw for your elevation, your windage. Um, you're gonna unloosen it, move it over with your hand, tighten it up. So this is perfect for guys that want a very simplistic sight. I personally shoot one arrow, uh, one weight for pretty much all my games. So for me, tinkering with the micro gang adjustment is just kind of an added feature that one, is more expensive, and two, I really don't need. Uh, the nice thing about the Pro Hunter HD, your pins are very easy to add and remove. So if you ever change your mind on your setup, you want to run a four pin versus the five, you can do that. You have a simple Allen here uh, to pull the, pull the pin out. So very easy to do. Uh, as far as your pins, you can see here, this is a three pin model. They're going to come green, yellow, green when you buy from SNS Archery. Your five pins are going to be green, red, yellow, green, red. Uh, what's really nice about these pro models in the black gold sites is they have the pro style pins. So the actual pin is tapered and a rounded off pin head. So it's going to give you the most precise aiming point. Uh, in my opinion, the best pins on the market by far. Uh, they just are hands down um, so bright yet don't overglow and just very precise. Um, we have black gold's photochromatic shell, their technology on kind of combating uh, light coming in or out to the fiber optics. Uh, here in the shop, it's kind of dim, so this is a clear color. It's allowing as much light as possible to make our pins really pop. Um, if I were to walk outside, very bright sunny day, this is going to turn a purple hue. It's going to block those uh, harsh rays so my pin doesn't overglow, it doesn't starburst. So just some cool technology that that black gold does here. That pretty much sums it up as far as this new Pro Hunter HD Streamline with the Delvetel mount. Um, you know, honestly, I think this is going to be perfect for the Western Hunter, uh, even Whitetail guys all around. This is going to be a phenomenal sight. There's not a big change from, you know, your original or your stock Pro Hunter HD, um, but just having that shorter windage bar is really just to accommodate your hand, make it a lot easier to turn. Uh, and like I said, bow specific for the Matthews bows, utilizing that bridge lock system. Uh, if you guys have any more questions about this site or anything else in the store that we carry, please feel free to give us a call, shoot us an email. We'd be glad to help. And thanks for watching, guys. Mm -hmm.